Greetings, viewers. I'm the Smithy99999, and welcome back to Take On Mars. Uh, yes, uh, starting back, we're back with our analyzing probe in or whatever crater we're in now. Uh, so let's get a look at what else we need to do for our space program. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, objectives. Okay, so we need to map six more, do about six more basic terrain mapping of Mars. Hmm. Nine more characterizing the behavior and composition of Martian atmosphere. Hmm. Okay. Now let's have a look. Uh, Okay, Victoria craters at night. Gale craters. Yep. We'll go back to Gale Crater, I guess. Ah, uh, we currently have a ship on that mission. Uh, mission details, mission details, mission details. Ah, just an explore. So we'll just send a regular probe. No point wasting valuable funds sending something which has all the tools which aren't required there. Peculiarity. Interesting name for a uh, uh, probing mission. I like that. That's a nice detail. Uh, what else have we got? What's the mission details here? Okay, so we need photos and an analyzer. Vehicle details for S Lander, what has it got? Hang on, let's just quickly budge back to our lab and build a lander which only has Cameras and uh, cameras and hmm, cameras and an PAS system. We won't need robot arms or anything, so we've got a nice cheap one to use for photo and environment scanning purposes only. Okay, we're in the clean room. Uh, construction. Uh, create new vehicle. Small lander, skeleton. Uh, we don't need that. We need an environmental analysis station. A low gain antenna. Have a basic images. And we'll put a chemical battery in. And excellent. Save that as small lander, yes, and the sand camera. Uh, I'm not going to give fancy names purely so. We can brief them. <laughs> Shorter than 22 cameras. Okay, SL, small lander, yeah, yeah, and camera. Excellent. Next construction. Now that I'll name them in a way which allows us to allows me to just quickly know what it is rather than waste time with. I'm trying to figure out looking at the vehicle details. So if we launch a this lander, yeah, it's in camera, but it's the cheapest lander we've got, and we'll launch it there. We will be able to explore, get our features, and our analysis. Uh, probably should also switch over to the... Uh, ah, nice. That was Fortuity 1. Yes. Evident the area contains high volume of phyllosilicates, indicating past water flows. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, uh, peculiarity. How's that mission going? 
damage. He's still coming down. Excellent. Excellent, 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 excellent. Hopefully, with a few more missions down the line, but Jim, we can start doing some real missions. Hopefully soon, we'll be able to go to Rovers, which will be a nice, interesting change up. It's well complete. Disconnect. Hmm. Now, how is our budget going anyway? Ah, good. 118k. What other missions have we got here in Gale Crater? Uh, let's see. Mission details. Ooh. Okay, so we'll send a probe with an EAS to save some money. Yep. Alright, oh, they have cameras too. I could just use them instead of landers, but. Oh, well. No fun with just these. Vision, appropriate name. Hang on. Who was our. Was that Kuiper 1? Yes, Kuiper 1 is our new. Land. I'd say the, these ones with chemical batteries will last longer so we can do more. But there's an objective for long term effects of Martian atmosphere conditions on. So if we use a few more landers and probes that are a bit more robust, then we can use them as a stand point. Righty. Oh, look, look at the prisoners. Just wait for this baby to land. Mm-hmm. Well, let's explore. Tasks. Oh, wait, that, that was the other probe. That's already made it. Probes are quicker to land, makes sense. Less delicate parts can hit the ground a bit harder. Oh, well, not less delicate parts, but small. Less of these things. You know, which break incredibly easily. Hey, look at that. I think that's one of the probes. Oh yeah, and they use parachute rather than retro across the so that means they have to land harder. Okay, while that's landing, we'll switch back to vision. Doki. Okay. Using the EAS on that, baby. Switch back to Kuiper, she's landed. Awesome. Now, what have we got to do? Power cell. Analyze, okay. So, we're gonna start that analyzing. So, landers, not gonna make move. Disconnect. Mm. Uh, yes. So, I will try to use probes whenever necessary now just to save a bit of the budget. Whoa. Easy up there. Ah, this is the last mission in Gale Crater. What oh, mission details? Is this just an explore? Yeah, it's just an explore. So we'll just do a basic probe. Yep. Land it. Launch it, and Gale Crater is done a Rooney when, this, when these three missions are finished. And this one's just an explore, so we can leave it alone. Uh, switch back to vision. How's that? Uh, oh, halfway through the gas capture. Man, that looks beautiful. Keep dreaming, keep dreaming, keep dreaming. And analyze me. Uh, 
get okay. And how's Kuiper 1? Ah, she's nearly done with her capturing as well. Oh, there's Chance's mission done. Analyzing. Vision. Okie dokie. Uh oh. Game froze. Oh, I might have accidentally disconnected. Whoopsies! Back to the operator. Man, <laughs> frame rate's not holding up today. Holding up today. Hmm. Ah, based on soil analysis, it is evident that the air indicating fast water falls. Congrats. Kuiper 1. Oh, wait, is there anything? Nope, no mission assigned. Back to Kuiper 1. Oh, no peculiarity. Kuiper 1. Yep, more past water flows. But I believe you still have some missions left. Yes, photo. We'll do this in the first person view for once. Camera HUD. Where do we want the photos? Photo of designated area. Aha! One photo down. Ah, back this way. Handy seeing these little arrows. Uh, ah, ah. So we need to try and get the other view, which. Ooh. Uh, boom! Mission completrios. Ooh, and that's Gale Crater or Don Rooney. Alright. Okay, Gale Crater's done. Uh, which was the other crater we were we have missions on? I asked to Okay, what mission details have we got here? Explore, analyze, explore? Alright. Oh. Oh, we already have missions. Ah, this one has a lot of missions. Mission details. But we need photos. Uh huh. I think it's probably still best to launch landers for photo ops a little better. I don't know why, but I just feel that they're better for launching missions. Oh my, how appropriate, how appropriate. But let's have a look at those other missions which were in progress. Yes. So, this episode might run a bit longer today, but we will finish while and. Gale Craters in one. Not my art, Victoria. Okay. Let's connect to this probe, see how it's going on landing. I'm just going to disconnect and wait till daytime here in Victoria Crater. Let's get ahead three hours. Hmm. <laughs> Time is compared four hours. Again, number three. Wait, why don't I just go on here? Skip ahead for two hours this time. Ooh, nearly a 2000k budget.
Here we are. Toria Crate. I forgot about Kaiser Crate. Connect to vehicle. Better to do this, especially with low, low quality cameras and that in the daytime, I feel. There we go. Mission. Eh. Uh, how come you haven't explored the region? On a sign mission. Sign nearest. Okie dokie. I'm gonna sign your mission. Let's disconnect. Disconnect tonight. Okay, so that's bugged up a little. Connect to the vehicle and we'll end this episode as she lands. Oh, look at that. Mm. That is one beautiful paper. Such prettiness. Such, such prettiness. And as life touches down on Mars, I have been this 59999. This has been Take on Mars. Goodbye. Something appears to have gone wrong. The Falcons don't really much point, but it is a feature for those of you who want to try it. And here I am not wasting money by actually giving it a uh Sunny Pro uh, Lander which does pretty much which only apart from the soil detector can do everything that machine